hi everyone and welcome to my channel in this video i'm going to show us the step-by-step -step guide to regain freedom from bright vpn as you all know this has been trending for quite some time and uh, all of a sudden i open up my system today and i discover you no know, i've been seeing this for a like few days now that each time my system is loading up i will see uh, a flash of uh, command environments writing vpn something but i choose i was surprised you know i didn't know what exactly what was going on so today as i was browsing through i discovered a vpn is a logo on my on my uh, panel so i decided to toggle on it and see what it is and when i toggle on it i saw bright vpn so i was surprised how the bright vpn came about because i knew i knew i didn't install any vpn called bright vpn so i quickly dashed on to google to search and i discovered that a lot of people have similar problem you know getting bright vpn installed on their system without their consent so i did my research and uh, i'm going to implement what i've done as a research and also to show you guys the way you can remove bright vpn from your system if uh per adventure you you have a counter or you encounter such um situation like my own case now so without any further ado we're going to go straight to this course so if you know you've not subscribed to my channel please don't forget to subscribe and click the bell icon so they get notified each time i upload fresh content so what you need to do you open up your browser it could be chrome it could be firefox it could be microsoft edge it could be opera any of the browser you are using it could be safari for those using mac so just open uh, your browser and go to search i prefer google so just come to the search bar type book book crap on installer and click a search then the first result you see on the on the home page of google search is the one you click you see bcuninstaller.com so just click on it and it will take you to bc uninstaller website now it has two options download on first hub download on osdn so we will download on first hub just click on download on first hub and it'll take you to first hub channel so you just see just click on it has two options but you select bulk crab on a solar portable you click on this and to download i've downloaded it but let me just show you once you click on it the download will start so i'm going to pause this download because i want to cancel it i've already installed this app so once you install you come to the installer and extract you extract click on extract and extract this into a folder then after you finish on install, uh, extracting it there's no that you need to do just locate where they say bc on installer with this uh, logo just double click it or right click and open and click yes so allow it to scan your system would allow this to scan my system can see scan registry for an installer and all that so can see it's doing scanning so you can see the scanning takes uh, a while like 30 seconds or there about depending on the speed of your system so but before we proceed i'm going to show you something now if i click here you see the bright vpn is showing and i'm seeing another web indexing service and also going to research on this i know why this is here and also remove it web indexing i also check on this um bug crap on install and see if i can find that web indexing i will delete it so you see let me open it so that you see what i'm saying open bright vpn you can see the bright vpn i never knew how this came about
you can see it's off so you can see states that are on the bright vpn so now i'm not interested i want to uninstall so let me close this first so uh we have already scanned let's go through just take it easy or just come here and type bright you can see bright vpn you can search it direct or you you just scroll through when you scroll through it's in, on alphabetical order you can see b this is bright vpn just click on it and you see on install quietly on install so i'm going to uninstall I click on uninstall click on continue it's a key all processes so it's already running on the prep you see the power of this bulk craft on installer it's kill all the processes because these processes are already running on your processor so without you killing those processes you cannot uninstall this program so click on continue general setting prevent system shutdown and restart so now i click prevent shutdown and restart create a restore point before uninstalling disable protection and all that so you can see can I just leave it the way it is and uh, proceed click continue begin on installing you can see total estimated size 184.99 files are still used by running no create a new restore point yes no 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 i don't need to create on install be silent no concurrent on installation is enabled let's see Okay, you can see that's key the process. So it's not showing you here again. So let's begin. I didn't want it to create a restore point. So in your own case, you can go through the option, the settings, and ensure that there's no restore point. Because there's of no use. It's of no use for me. So there's no need of creating a restore point. But since it has started, let's just leave it. So but in your own case. Ensure you don't create a restore point. Uninstalling. Quiet. No. You can see all the files associated. You can see. Oh my god. So I'm going to delete all that is associated to this. Delete all. can see some of them are refusing so we're going to try repeat the process again so guys this is the screen um the notification i got after uninstalling the bright vpn using the tools i showed us earlier so immediately i restarted my system i got this uh, prompt and windows cannot find c program files bright vpn so it's, it was trying to boot you know and start displaying this as i'm running on the background but the uninstallation process have killed and remove the bootable devices so guys you can see this is how you can remove bright vpn from your system so guys after uninstalling the bright vpn i still discover that i still have some of the folders on my system so the next step you're going to do now is go to your pro your c your local disk click on it go to program file x6 s86 locate where you see bright vpn you can see the folder bright vpn is still there so you can come here and click 
permanently delete or you press and shift key and delete so i just click on permanently delete and click yes click continue so let's run bc on install again and see what's going to happen now okay you can see we still have a trace of this bright so let's search for bright again and make sure we delete every you can see bright data service allows free use of certain features in an app you install so i'm going to remove it bright data we don't need anything related to bright net of data you can see key or Okay, let's see since we've killed the process let's see if we can remove it directly great great you can see what we simply did it was still running so that is why we couldn't delete it from the c program file so all i simply did i open the bulk crap on installer i killed the process and after killing the process i went back to my window c and located this and deleted it you can see there are no entry matching bright vpn you can see i remember when i opened there i was seeing something web indexing and all that so these are part of the bright vpn that was still remaining on my system after even uninstalling and you see the way it took us time to uninstall we didn't we were unable to delete it all at the same time because that web services was running so that process was not able to uninstall or delete at that point in time so guys you can see our system is free or my system is free from bright vpn you can see there are no entry matching your search criteria if you go back to my program file see program file can't find bright vpn again so it's gone so that is how you can get rid of bright vpn on your system i hope this video helped so if you have any comment or you find it difficult to navigate you can leave the comment below on this video so that i can also guide you you know on how you can go about it i can guide you follow you up till you execute your process and get rid of the bright vpn on your system so guys that is it for this video I really appreciate you guys for watching. God bless you all. Bye for now.